Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to cut out your fin alignment jig and I'm also going to show you how to glue your fins onto your body tube. If you remember, a fin alignment jig helps you keep your fins in place while they are drying once you put glue on them. So let's first start out by taping your drawing onto the piece of cardboard that you're going to cut out for your fin alignment jig. Once you've got your drawing taped down, we can follow the lines on your drawing and cut out the trace of your fin alignment jig. You can use a straight edge to help you cut straight. Now that the fin alignment jig is cut out and prepared, we can glue our fins onto our body tube. The reason I'm showing you this CAD model is because in my tutorial video I have right angles on my fin tabs, but before you glue them on you want to chamfer your fin tabs just like this right here and this right here. The reason you want to chamfer your fin tabs is because you don't want your corners to hit the glue from when you glued on your centering rings. The glue will most likely be right located right here and right here. So just make sure that you chamfer your fin tabs right before you glue them on. You can take it to the belt sander to do that. To begin gluing our fins, we're going to put glue in two main places. We're going to put it on the fin tab and on the root cord. You can use a popsicle stick to spread the glue along the edges of the fin tab and the root cord. Don't be shy to use a good amount of glue as well because you really want the fins to be glued in place well. Remember that if you're building a level 2 rocket, you should be using epoxy. Once you have glue on your fins, you just have to stick them in their fin slots and do the same process for the rest of the fins. Once you finish putting glue on all of your fins, you're going to want to stand your rocket up. We are going to now slide our fin alignment jig over the fins so that the fins can be, in this video, 90 degrees apart from each other. So let's slide the fin alignment jig over. You want to make sure that your fins will fit into the slots of your fin alignment jig snug. And now we can let this sit in place so that the fins can dry.